Well, the unfortunate movie tanker accident from last week has sparked up a conversation about the safety of our roads, and the appropriate authorities have promised to look into it. In recent past, filmmaker Stanley Ohikwari directed a movie about how these tankers and their drivers have been stereotyped in a manner which sometimes clouds the better judgment that might help find solution to some of the challenges that causes this mishap. Take a look. Early last year, movie director Stanley Ohikware broke the internet with a fire stunt from his new movie. In the movie, a road safety official played by Annie Iyo was badly burnt while trying to rescue victims at an accident scene. Fast forward to present day, the movie titled Behind the Wheels officially screened. It chronicles the plight of heavy-duty vehicle drivers taking a particular tanker driver as a case study in the hope to disprove the narratives that tanker drivers are usually careless and reckless on the road. I have come to ask you one simple question. One question that if answered right could be the difference between living and dying. They believe that because we drive big trucks, we block their view, we slow down their movement. Um, because of behavior of some of our members, uh, they believe all of us are irresponsible. And they it cross, it's, it's a system in Nigeria. It cross across all profession. So the tanker driver is part of the system. The movie is produced by a young movie enthusiast, Ugochuku Azikiwe, who also has a day job where he works closely with the Petrol Tanker Drivers Association of Nigeria. His direct experiences and exposure with this group of professionals inspired a desire to tell their story. As an insider, because I work with the union, PTD, Petroleum Tanker Drivers Union, and uh, I am close to these people, tanker drivers, so I know what they go through on a daily basis. I know their challenges, and, uh, and these people, I know the role they play in the in, in Nigeria, you understand, to improve our economy. So, and uh, to me, I thought to myself, okay, why can't we just tell a story about those people? Let's see how we can market these people to the public so that people can really know what these people are going through. These people, they are, they, they are people that are like me and you. They have their own challenges, they, they have their own feelings. And either I like it or not, these things have affect them in one way or the other, you understand? So the, the, the inspiration behind this project is to say the pain, to say the, the, the suffering, the challenges of these tanker drivers to the public, for everybody to know. Everybody don't they talk in no you two could do our own. What's happening? How do we the 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 pro for this country? Where the girls the day separate? Which year you walk? Now they ask you which year you walk? What is the problem? What is not the problem? Oh, Fast rising actor Kelechi Ubede, most popular for his online comedy series Officer Titus, played the lead role in the movie, which also stars Patrick Doyle and Liz Benson. I don't get what that's for. Um, preparing myself to play the role of a tanker driver, I had to go stay with them for a while. I spent like two weeks. Um, with the tanker drivers, interviewing them, I had to drive a tanker, so I learned how to drive. It was um. There was a whole lot put into it because most times in some of the movies we do, we don't have enough time to research and all that because you have to flip this and go to the next set. But in this one, we had to relax. I had to be the tanker driver. So I ate with them, spoke with them, spoke language with them, played with them. All that prepared me to play the character. And when I was acting, I wasn't just acting as a tanker driver. I was a tanker driver. <laughs> Okay, okay, that's, that's good to hear because it's very important that these tanker drivers are sensitized or sensitive. I mean, the rate of tanker road accidents is an alarming high. This is this sensitized what you talk about. When you drive our driver, then that's what you want to do. I want to do precisely. What I want um, people to take away from this movie, because we try to do a conscious movie, is first, do not judge. 
a whole lot, lot of these people go through worse than we do. Um, most of the tanker drivers carry fuel and petroleum products from one end of the country to another. Sometimes they're two days on the road, they don't close their eyes. They don't have trailer parks. Sometimes the money, I can't even see the amount of money that's been paid to them monthly. It's a write-off. Um, someone in the States told me, look, I prefer to be a tanker driver in the United States than probably working in a bank or working some other great job here somewhere because they pay them well. If these guys say they're not working tomorrow, they shut down the economy. So what I want people to take away from this is we need to respect it a little bit more and look into their welfare. Welfare is very important. Mentally, emotionally, they're human beings. The way you bleed is the way they bleed. The issues you have are the issues they have. But this is worse because they have to do a high-risk job every day. 